Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Roger Skaka Sungura YouTube channel. A big thank you to each and every one of you for your continued support. Those fans who are supporting us in this very platform and those who are supporting us in our charity work platform. As you can see from the background, the studio today looks beautiful. We have been recording on a green screen. But today we have a real studio that uh, is not the one for the green screen. Actually, this one is real. Yeah. <laughs> a big thank you for your support. And uh, briefly before I jump into politics, Kaka, in our charity work, we are looking for to add more cameras because there are those people who have real life stories who want to tell us their stories. Maybe you have undergone through difficult times in life and you could wish the public to know what you've gone through. We have prepared a studio for you and we are raising more cameras for the same. So if you love Kakasungura and you could wish to donate a camera or a studio light to Rogers Kakasungura, we will highly appreciate our MPS numbers are down there. You can support whatever you can. We are looking for, we are looking to add a 90D camera is about 220,000, a complete one. So if God gives you the grace to support us, we will highly appreciate. Back to politics. Kaka, there's something I've been thinking all along. One, the former president Uhuru Kenyatta has been positioning himself as an East African leader, right? A regional leader, a leader who can bring together East Africa. We've seen him traverse countries. In other countries, he's invited to bring peace and maybe to initiate unity talks among leaders. That has been happening for a couple of months since he left power in 2022. Uru Kenyatta told us, my candidate is Raila Molo Odinga. Even after leaving power, Uru stood firm in rallies and telling us, my candidate in this country is Raila Amolo Odinga. My Azimio party leader is Raila Amolo Odinga. He's been saying that all along. Now, in the quest for Raila Odinga to contest for the AU position, I have not seen Uhuru Kenyatta come in public to declare his support to Raila Odinga. We know they are closely related. They are buddies. They have been working as brothers. But since Raila Odinga announced that, yes, I want to contest for the AU top position, I have not seen Uru Kenyatta speak. As an East African real, uh, leader, we all know his endorsement will play a bigger role in supporting Raila Molo Odinga. Now, Kaka, this is myself. I have been asking myself, maybe, maybe Uhuru also had interest in this position. That's a question I'm asking myself. And using the available uh, happenings, I am going to try and find answers to that question. Let's ponder this bit by bit. When Uru Kenyatta supported Raila Odinga in the 2022 general election, he became an enemy of William Ruto. And actually several times, Rigard used to announce, we are not fighting Raila Odinga, we are fighting the person sponsoring Raila Molo Odinga, who they believed is Uru Kenyatta. Now, Uru was a political enemy to William Ruto, and regard Gashawa. These two people have taken up the power. Uru Kenyatta has been positioning himself as an East African leader. Ruto has come 
Ruto has positioned himself as an African leader. He tells African presidents, we want to form our own currency. He tells African presidents, our young people don't need to go and seek jobs abroad. As Africans, we are able to do that. Some of the African leaders began to trust William Ruto. Now, Ruto positioned himself as an African leader. Uru Kenyatta positioned himself as an East African leader. Now, I have been telling you, William Ruto is a man who sees tomorrow. He is a man who sees 10 years ahead of us. A cunning president. Ever cheeky. Maybe Ruto got wind that Ur Kenyatta is salivating for the position. To punish him, let me quickly endorse Raila Odinga. So, Raila Odinga has been endorsed. It has gone in the public ahead of Uru Kenyatta. Uru had not yet announced himself. Maybe he was planning to do so, or he was trying to weigh, or he was trying to find out a few things before declaring interest. Raila Odinga has declared interest. William Ruto has quickly supported him. Could it be a way of Ruto trying to show Uru Kenyatta that yes, though you didn't respect me as your deputy, my position as the Kenyan president has given me authority to influence support for Raila Odinga instead of you. Then if at all this was not the idea, why up to this time, Uru Kenyatta hasn't come publicly and endorsed Raila Odinga? Despite telling us severally, Raila Odinga is my candidate. Despite telling us severally, I support Raila Odinga. Why now, he support Raila for presidency? Raila said, I'm going for AU. Why has he not supported Raila? Uru Kenyatta, though retired, is a friend to so many African presidents, sitting and retired. I have been waiting. I have never spoken this because I have been waiting to see if at all we will see him publicly endorse Raila Odinga. Yes, and done so. Can I conclude or let me conclude that maybe in one way or the other it's conflict of interest. Who wanted the position? Raila has taken it up. Because Ruto, an enemy of Uru Kenyatta, has endorsed Raila Odinga, Uru now has pulled back. Wait. Don't be surprised. Don't be surprised to see Uru Kenyatta, Kalonzo Msioka, forming an alliance. Don't be surprised. Don't be surprised. In the new merger, I have seen Gideon Moy being revived into the ship. Moy had disappeared. In the same boat, I have seen Charity Ngiru resurfacing. In the same boat, I have seen Jimmy Wanjigi resurfacing. Jimmy Wanjigi alipotea pote hapa katikati kidogo. Sasa ameanza kuonekana, ameanza kukuja mstari wa mbele. In the same pot, I have seen Mwangi Wairia resurfacing again. Mwangi Wairia alienda chini ya maji kidogo. I have seen him resurfacing again. Don't be surprised to see an alliance backed by President Uhuru Kenyatta. But kaka sungula, let me say this. In all, Politics is a game. And when the politics is a game, you look at where you can easily score a goal. From this platform, 
I wish Baba Raila Molo Odinga the best in his quest. And we believe Raila Odinga is best suit for this position. I know that. When you read Raila Odinga's curriculum vitae, you see a potential AU chair. And this is happening at a time when Raila needs a dignified position. Because in a jua, hata kibaki hapa Kenya, 2027 tena, huyu mungwana munaita Ruto, huyu, huyu Ruto, huyu. <laughs> Kama aliba akiwa inje, na akiwa ndani, I have not given up, but those are facts we cannot erase. God bless you, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, if you want to support our studio, your welcome and person number is down there, and God will bless you. You are 2,000, you are 5,000, you are 10,000. You are 100,000, you are 200,000, will be a great boost to us. God bless you, ladies and gentlemen. See you in the next video. Asante Nisan.